Assalamu alaikum What up there, catch you guys, Josh here, back from another video. It is officially 4.41 in the morning, bro. It's a Friday. We finna get the games because today is the official day of the mock meet. Alhamdulillah, bro. Dude, I could not sleep at all last night. I was so ready for the day, man. I just literally could not fall asleep. I eventually did and then woke up like three hours later, like 3.30 in the morning. I was like, dude. I'm so ready, bro. Let's go. So, let's see how we do, man. Inshallah. I haven't tested my one rep maxes in almost eight months, dude. So, I'm excited, man, to see what type of weight your boy can push, your boy can move by the permission of Allah. That being said, dude, let's get to the gym. All right, bro. We're fitting to get an official weigh in before we go lift, dude. Your boy normally takes about half a scoop of Project One pre workout because it's 350 milligrams, so we're gonna take about half of it. But today, we're doing what my Canadian friends do. We're just gonna send it. I don't know, I just woke up from a little nap. It's a little dark, but you guys silly? I'm still gonna send it. 350 milligrams, bro. Straight to the dome, let's go. Sorry, the guns are in the way, bro. 160 on the money, guys. 160 on the money, let's go. Alright dude, so we just hit 290, that's our opener. And it didn't feel great, but on footage, it looked actually pretty good. Um, I have my sticking point right at the hole, but other than that, man, it moved pretty quick, so we're gonna go ahead and bump it up to 310 pounds. Uh, this would be, it wouldn't be an all-time PR, it'd be five pounds below. But again, this is just our second attempt. We're gonna go ahead, do 315, and gauge how that, you know, how that feels, inshallah. And then based on that, dude, we might go for an all-time life PR, gym PR, but hey man, it's a PR regardless. So let's do it, bro. bro. So the only consistent gym partner that I've ever found right there tells me that I need to go for 325 pounds, which would be a 10 pound all time PR, dude. I think we're just gonna send it. <laughs> well, that hurt, but the ET still runs, so round two. <laughs> I'm just in that mood. I'm feeling Canadian today. We're gonna send it. So 325, that would be again a 10 pound all time PR, which, if everything else goes according to plan, bench and deadlift, your boy might just end up in the thousand pound club. And that would be an amazing accomplishment, an amazing milestone that uh, is something that I can, I can brag for at least three days to my wife and kids. <laughs> Let's get it, dude. Alright dude, alhamdulillah, we just hit 325 pounds, a 10 pound all-time PR man, and it looked like I still had some of the tank because that sticking point right out the hole is very deceiving man. I know every single time I hit it, I never think to myself, dude I ain't got this. I always think to myself, dude be patient, you got this, the strength is there, and it's not even like fake hype, it's just I know exactly how much strength I got, alhamdulillah. So alhamdulillah, dude, we just hit 325, now we're about to warm up on bench. Let's see if we can get another all-time PR. We got momentum now in our favor, alhamdulillah. Let's see if we can hit 225 pounds, two plates, dude. This will be an all-time PR again. Let's get it. All right, dude, so we just hit 210 and that looked absolutely horrible, but I think that was a fluke, man, because in training, just like a week or two ago, dude, I hit 210 and it was like a RP7. It looked really easy just a couple weeks back, man. So I'm gonna say that was a fluke, dude. I'm gonna reset, I'm gonna focus, man. 
regain my composure, dude, and we're gonna go for 220 pounds, which would be a five pound PR, all time PR. Hopefully I can smoke this and then go for that two plates, man. Inshallah, let's do it. <laughs> Alright dude, so clearly bench did not go as we had intended, but alhamdulillah our confidence is at an all time high dude. We don't let this affect our confidence dude, we're about to go smash a deadlift inshallah. Inshallah we're going to hit some PRs again dude. And it is what it is man, you know, we tra in training we uh, we were doing great dude, but maybe that uh, that squat took, you know, maybe it smoked this man, but we are uh, having a great time dude, this is awesome, it's so much fun man. You know, I ain't taking it too serious, dude. It's all about enjoying, you know, and being grateful, dude, that I get to lift, man. So, no PRs on the bench, but alhamdulillah, we're about to go smash deadlift, inshallah. Hopefully we can hit some PRs. And uh, Allah Allah, man, if we're gonna get that 1,000 pound club, but it's, again, dude, it's all good, bro. It is all good, let's go. <laughs> So I just had like a 10 minute laugh with my boy Chris over there. Dude, it happens bro, it happens man. Sometimes dude, you need a little bit of rocket boost to get the weight up man. And that was my last warm up. <sighs> Feeling good, I feel good now. My, my stomach's nice and light. I feel like I can, uh, can attack this weight man. And uh, I'm probably gonna go viral and it's all right. I'm okay with that dude. But that's what it takes man, to achieve your dreams. Let's do it, bro. Bismillah. All right, dude, so we just hit an all-time sumo PR. That was our first attempt, 415 pounds. Now, that's not an all-time PR. The most we've ever pulled is 435 conventional, um, but that is all-time sumo PR. I made sure that I farted before I went on my first attempt, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so that I don't go viral for, you know, twice, I guess. So now we're about to go for 440, which if I hit this, inshallah, it's gonna be an all-time PR, whether it's conventional or sumo. So let's see if we got this in the tank, man. Your boy's feeling kind of smoked at this point, um, but we're gonna just give her, man. We're gonna send it, full send, dude. And if we hit 440, then dude, we're gonna go for like probably like 455 or something like that. So let's get it. And that is a wrap, boys and girls, alhamdulillah. We have had a tremendous day so far, alhamdulillah, man. Super happy with the results. Man, 10 pound PR on the squat with some left in the tank, alhamdulillah. 210 on the bench, man. Bench didn't go like planned, but alhamdulillah, we're just grateful that we get to bench, man. 440 on sumo, all time PR. Went for 455, it moved off the floor pretty quickly, man, but I just, I felt my lower back rounding and I was like nah dude not today man and uh, alhamdulillah so we're healthy injury free and now we're going into you know basically my next meet inshallah my next mock, mock meet is gonna be 225 days from now inshallah we're gonna start with a bridge block then we're gonna basically go you know alternate between hypertrophy ie muscle building strength hypertrophy peaking and then the meat inshallah is a gel 
Also, Monday, I start 75 hard. Today is Friday. So Monday in Charlotte, I'm starting 75 hard. And I'm gonna start doing my half marathon training. You know, alhamdulillah, man. I'm super excited, inshallah. Uh, and, you know, all praises for Allah, man. I hope that you guys have enjoyed uh, today's video, man. I hope it inspired you, inshallah, to get after it, man. And, uh, you know what I'm saying? Just see what your potential is, dude. And never, ever, ever settle, man. Complacency is death. As always, guys, stop stressing yesterday. Stop fearing tomorrow. Make today great. And I will see you in that next one. If you're like me, dude, you've been spending years covering up how you really feel inside. You continue to put on this facade for the people around you, man, because you don't actually want them to know just how broken you are inside. You spend your days filling up your days with things that make you laugh or forget, but it never actually makes you feel any better, man. In fact, the harsh reality